Hey guys, this is SB737 and welcome back today to another video on my Skyblock Challenge and uh, we are being joined by a few extra people today, a couple of skeletons and uh, there are also a couple of people who are basically, uh, you let one person on your island and then they're only a pilot. <laughs> see, I, 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 one person was like, oh, can I come see you? So yes, I did. And then uh, they invited somebody else. So, I mean, I don't mind because they can't break anything. As long as they don't like get in the way, I uh, I don't mind at all. Uh, but I'm going to take out this spider anyway. And uh, you see, I built a little extra section here, you notice, yeah? Uh, this is this has been seen before. And the, the grass over by me chicken is slowly spread out. I'm going to try and kill this creeper without it killing anything else. Oh, get out of the way, get out of the way. Yeah, we did it just about. <laughs> Almost blew up on this, this skeleton. Let's get rid of him as well. Um... Wait, where's my chicken gone? Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. He, he was here like five minutes ago. It wasn't anything new with you guys, was it? No, these can't actually kill anything, I don't think. So, oh no, my chicken, my chicken needs no more. I, or can they kill some? If they can, they are, they are going to be dead meat. But I don't think, no, they can't. I know they can't. I know they can't for a fact, okay? So, oh no. Me, me, Charlie the chicken has gone. So we've got a chicken despawning problem. That's that's basically what it seems to be, doesn't it? Okay, right. Well, I don't know what to do about that then. I can't, I can't keep animals. <laughs> Let me know in the comments. <laughs> how do you fix it, animals from despawning? How, how, how do you solve that problem? Because my chicken keeps getting away and I don't like it at all. Okay, anyway, right. Let's uh, let's get building today. So today I thought, well, I thought, I'm, well, this is what I'd like to do. I'd like to build a house for a villager and... I'd like to think that the villager isn't going to despawn, okay? So, I'm going I'm to build it anyway. <laughs> it might be empty for a bit if uh, the villager keeps uh, despawning. So, yeah, I'm going to build it uh, right here. Right in this spot. And, uh, yeah, and just sort of do uh, this sort of a, a shape around here like so. Hopefully, they don't get in the way of me placing blocks. Otherwise, I'll just kick them off the island or something. Um, <laughs> I'll get very all fay with the old kick uh, kick tool, uh, kick uh, commands again, won't I? Um, so, yeah. Uh, and then I think I'm going to put a furnace here. No, wait. Facing inside so you can actually use it from inside the house. That's, that's probably a good idea, isn't it? Uh, so, let's pick up this furnace. There we go, we did. Uh, it's just a little bit laggy, isn't it? There we go. So, we put that there. And then I'm going to need a door and a door there. I thought... I'll make it so that the villager can come across here as well. So, you know, we can, we can, we're sort of, you know, nice locals kind of a thing, you know, like local neighbours. So that, you know, <laughs> don't have to go all the way around to visit. We could just go across there. Although that means I'm going to need to make uh, some gates. So, yeah, I need to make them gates. I also need, I think if I go ahead and, I'd like to use fencing as the, this bit of the wall now, I think. I think that's a little bit better than um, and than any other any other sort of material, you know. Like I just I like I, I I was thinking of designs, and I think it'd be nice to make it out of fence, maybe or maybe I don't know. Yeah, I think I think I'm happy with that. So like fencing round there, and then um like a, and then like a cobblestone slab roof. So it almost got the almost as oh, how did I miss that? <laughs> so it's almost got like a the same design as my other house, really. If I put a slab here, then I can sort of. Uh, get up a little bit easier. Can't. Well, I could do this anyway without the slab. <laughs> I don't need a slab to get up here. <laughs> uh, so yeah, if I go ahead and uh, just slab a dab dab up this river, I don't think I'm actually going to have enough slabs. Uh, but not to worry, we can easily make some more. But yeah, that's the basic uh, the basic concept of the house, I think. Uh, so if we uh, also bring this out forward one as well. So if we just get that there, there we go. Um, okay, right. So we've still got two two gaps there. And uh, now I'm going to have to go and visit the old cobblestone generator and get some more cobblestone. And um, by the way, in between episodes, I uh, <laughs> I fell off my island. <laughs> I'll show you. I'll show you what happened. I won't recreate it, but <laughs> I nearly did it once, and I was like, oh, that was close. I should patch it up, but I thought, no, I won't be stupid enough to do it again. I won't fall off. And then, uh, yeah, I fell off. So. <laughs> Yeah, it's a it's a dangerous island. I'll I'll put it that way. I mean, I'm I'm trying to make it more and more safe all the time by adding fences and stuff. But you know, you can't safety proof everything, can you? Uh, so uh, yeah, what I'm going to do is grab a load of this cobblestone and then uh, get a few uh, get a few slabs. Uh, so that should uh, keep uh, keep production going, shouldn't it? Nicely. Um, so yeah, I'll recreate it as soon as I've got I've got enough. I'm not sure how many I'm going to need actually. Um, right, right, let's just uh, okay. We actually picked all of them. How do we get? We've got 18. Hmm, is 18 going to be enough? I'd say we go for let's go for. 30, because that's then any that's then 60 slabs, so then that should be more than enough, shouldn't it? As you can see, we're picking them all up. Like, if they go over there, we still eventually pick them up. Because he, can he pick up my, my slabs? Wait, let's just see. My items. I think he can, can't he? Yeah, he, he probably can. Okay, I just hope... Because if, if, if any of you two killed my chicken, I am going to... I am going to... Oof, you don't want to know what I'm doing. <laughs> Actually, let me have a look at hold the whole... Um, the whole slash IS thing here. So, his island level... Okay, 
There's, there's, there, we can change the biome. Uh, uh, island lock. Lock so players that so cannot enter the island. Unlock your island, can enter your island. Only your island members can break blocks. Aha. So, as long as I don't make anyone a member of the island, that's okay. Right. I can let them visit, just don't make them a member. Okay, you've got to, <laughs> nobody's being a member of my island. So, the chicken must have despawned. But, I'm so, I'm so, I'm so annoyed that the chickens do that. I mean, there must be a way to keep animals, but I just... I can't work it out. I haven't I haven't come across the way yet. I mean, I've I've lost a thousand in trying to keep me animals safe basically. <laughs> um right. I'm out of coal as well now. It's all it's all going wrong, isn't it? Um have I got I've got some in here. Aha, we've got a bit in there. So we'll shove in that gold all there. Um at least we've got a bit more food. I did have to stock up on food because I lost it all, didn't I? Um oh, there's a load of chicken in there as well. That's good. Uh, good news, isn't it? We'll put the iron ore in there and um if we go ahead and uh, I want to put that in there, don't I? There we go, and then if we go and drop... Oh no, my pickaxe! No, 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 there we go, so, so, okay. Okay, I got it. I don't know if they can pick it up on, actually, um, because they probably would have if they could have. Um, so, uh, next, I need to go and uh, get back to uh, get back to work. So, there's a crafting table over here, and I'm going to just drop off a few um, a few things into these chests as well. I wonder how long they can, they'll manage to just, you know, keep, keep you know, have the sanity to keep wandering around as well. <laughs> you know, I, I'd get bored quite fast, but obviously, I'll you know, see how long these guys stick it out for staying around. So, uh, let's see, how many slabs? So we make, we got 28, which is, is probably enough, isn't it? So, uh, let's, uh, let's go across there, and, uh, well, let's, yeah, we need to make quite a few, so, how about we go for that many? There we go, 48, perfect, okay. So now, we've got an, we've got a nice roof, there we go, and now we've just got to, uh, finish it off. Uh, so, if I even stand on this, and I can stand on that, and then I can get get up on the roof because you have to be up on the roof to proper to make a proper job of it, don't you? So this is going to keep the uh, the rain off my villager. I really hope you can keep animals, and they, there's a way to not make name tags. Of course, of course, that's how you stop them from despawning, isn't it? Hmm, that's what I've got to get. I've got to get name tags. Aha! It just it just hit me like a ton of bricks. Did that? I was I was thinking, you know, what am I doing wrong? I'm doing something stupid, aren't I? And then I realised, if you name tag an animal, and then if it despawns then, then I'll be surprised. But that does mean there's going to be a few more costs involved, but it'll be worth it, won't it? So yeah, this is the little house, it's quite a, it's quite a nice little thing. Uh, I want to make some gates so the villager can't get out. <laughs> it's more like a prison than a... <laughs> Don't tell him this. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be more like a prison for a minute. Uh, so if we go ahead and um, make uh, a bunch of these. So how do we make gates? I think it's... Um, so we're going to need some sticks first. And I think it sticks on the outside. In fact, I'm going to need a few more. I want to make two gates. But let's just make... Okay, we've crafted it right. So we'll go and just do the uh, the same again, okay? So there we go. So that's going to be the, the second gate. And I um, also need a door. Okay, so you can make a door by doing that. <clears throat> I will actually want to, to do th uh, three doors, and I'm, I'm about to cough, so if I, well, I'm trying to hold back a cough. I think I've actually been successful in holding back the cough, actually. <laughs> it's gone now. Just a tickle in my throat. Uh, so if I put a gate there, there we go, and then we've got a door here, and because I want to give him a bit of, you know, a bit of room to, to run around, and should, we, should we put the door there? There we go, there we go, and then should we give him a bit of room to run around in? So he can have this area, okay? This is, from this point forward, is the, is the village's area, so... Uh, we'll go ahead and put that like that. See, okay, here's what happened. I'm walking back, okay, admiring me work, okay, and I walked back and fell down that gap there. See, there's two gaps. It's a dangerous place. In fact, in fact, that you know, that's, that's the last straw. I'm gonna, I'm gonna patch you up, okay? We're gonna make it so that nobody falls down there ever again, okay? There we go. That's much safer. <laughs> okay, so that is gonna be the uh, the village's little house. Um, I could add a few other little things in here, I think. Um. I, just, I mean, a bit of decoration. He's got some furnaces if he wants. Maybe a chest. A bed, ideally, but uh, I don't know if I can get that yet. Uh, so, uh, first, we do need money to get a villager, but now we need to also go and find out how much our name tags, okay? That's, like, my next thing, isn't it? You know, if I can work out how much name tags are and find out that they're actually quite a reasonable price, then, well, we'll be, we'll be all right, won't we? So, let's have a little see. So, warp uh, shop. Can you even buy name tags? I, I, I would have thought so, because I've seen named things. Uh, unless they're like some thing you can only get in an exclusive way. Because if you remember, we had that cow, didn't we? Uh, Daisy, I think she was called. Daisy the down Dancing Cow, who sadly fell off after... I, I looked after her for so long, and then she just committed suicide. Jumped, uh, well, I don't know if it, it, went, like, it might have been a, a terrible, nasty accident, but uh, she probably ran away. Oh, can you not get name tags? I would have thought they would be in this area if you can. Uh, I hope you can. Ah, you can! 
Only a hundred! Duh! We can probably afford it now. No, not quite. <laughs> and no matter how cheap it is, I can't afford it. <laughs> I can't afford anything. Oh, right, so... we Okay, right, so we, we know we can get that. We also need to save up for a village egg, which I think is over here, isn't it? Let's have a little look. Uh, rabbit villager egg. Fine, so we need 600. What are we on at the moment? Let's have a little, uh, a little look. 75. Okay, so we need to scrape together uh, quite a bit of, uh, quite a bit of cash. Okay, and also, I was given a present. I was given an ender chest by uh, Telius Hippo, who put I love SP7 stuff. So we'll have the old donation chest going back up, I think, like we had on, like we had on the uh, the other server, uh, the prison server, so that's, that'll be good, won't it? Um, I think we can sell some redstone and probably some lapis as well, actually, whilst we're uh, whilst we're um, here. What am I doing? What, what am I doing? Right, take that away, put that there, put that there, get that there. So if we have a couple of uh, stacks of lapis, uh, a stack of redstone as well, and if I could get a bit more iron, that might... Do we have... What was... Okay, so we've got one one iron smelt in there. Here we are. We're just, like, scraping together everything I have now. If we can just get a bit of that and a bit of that, we might be able to just about put together something. <laughs> so, I don't think I'm going to have to fall in yet. So, that's 50. 50. 100. That's 150. Right? Eh? That's, that's, that's commendable. Now then, can we, can we sell some of this stuff over here as well? Because if we can... Then that could be handy. So, oh, we've got loads of pumpkins. So if we go and uh, sell some um, some pumpkins as well, I don't know how many stacks of pumpkins we've got, but I think they're probably not worth that much either. Maybe a stack for fifty or something like that. Uh, but it might be better than nothing, mightn't it? So yeah, we'll we'll have a look. I've not planted the cactuses yet either, have I? Right. Oh, we've got quite a few of them though as well. So uh, let's just get all of these uh, planted down. And they can be growing, but it looks like all my crops have pretty much grown now. So if I harvest them, and we'll see what we can we can scrape together, we'll try and uh, sell some stuff. I haven't really got that much wheat yet, have I? I'm um, still working on uh, building up wheat. I mean, the wheat, I wonder if it's just so far away it just doesn't grow. That's That might be what it is. Uh, that's the only excuse I can think of for it. Uh, let's pick up them pumpkins as well, yeah. Um, so we'll go ahead and... If we go and take a, a couple of stacks of, pump, of uh, cactuses with us... Um, what have we got in here? Sugar cane. Uh, if we take a couple of stacks of sugar cane, uh, we'll we'll get some melons as well whilst we're uh, in the area. Have we got a, an axe, maybe? Yeah, let's uh, let's let's use the most eff effective tool. Uh, so uh, we'll grab. Yeah, we'll get get all these melons. We'll. Cr I don't know what you sell actually. Do you sell melon itself or do you sell melon blocks? Hmm, that's an interesting point, isn't it? Maybe we should, you know, check out the old shop before we. Uh, Jump to any uh, melon conclusions. Um, let's grab some pumpkins as well. Uh, let's see how many have we got. So we've actually got quite a bit. We might be able to get. Yeah, we can get two stacks worth of pumpkins out there. That's not bad. I'm quite quite proud with those those efforts. Um, we're not going to grab any more sugar cane. Wheat. How are we doing in the wheat department? Um, no, not too bad, but could be better. I think that's that's the words we're going for. Right. Let's let's go warp shop. And just sort of see what, what pricing they're offering us first before we, we commit to anything. I haven't got my potato patches going yet. That's another thing I need to do. So we can sell... So if we sell the pumpkin, so that's that's our extra 100. The, the cacti are actually worth a lot more than pumpkins. So they're definitely worth investing a bit more in, aren't they? Yeah. And then melon blocks as well. We can probably make quite a few melon blocks. So that's worth... Um, Worth investing into, isn't it? Uh, what else did I bring? Sugar cane. Is sugar cane over here? Nope, but I bet you can sell it somewhere. Here we go. So, sugar cane, yeah, not bad. You know, not, it's better than nothing, I suppose. Um, <laughs> and wheat seeds. If we got loads of wheat seeds, but I don't think we are going to, but just for argument's sake. Oh, nether wart. Now then, that's not bad pricing either, is it? So, if we could make like a massive nether wart farm, then that's good money. So, it looks like the best money is going to be the cactus and the. Um, and the wheat, yeah. Let's have a look at the old, the old bal. So 425. How much did we need? We needed, we need 600. So we're nearly there. If I think if we sell the melons, we might actually have enough, uh, enough funds to uh, get a villager. That's nice, still, yeah. <laughs> Once he leaves, he knows he can never return. So <laughs> he's sticking around. Right. Let's have a little see. So assuming we have enough melon, which let's be honest, I'll be very surprised if I don't have enough melon. Uh, we'll, uh, we'll be able to make it, yeah. Uh, so let's go over here and uh, and grab that. So uh, how do I do this best? Do I just sort of go like that? Yeah, I think that's how it's how it's best done, isn't it? Uh, so sort of drag it round, and then uh, yeah, I need ideally a at least what well, I need a stack basically for this to work out. I've already got twenty seven. Yeah, so we've got enough. That's good news, isn't it? And then we can go ahead 
and not quite have enough for one more. But, oh no, we've only got 59. Oh no, we've, there's more There's more in this chest actually. So that's that's a good thing, isn't it? So if we just um, go over to this chest and grab that. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll grab uh, those. So we have a stack of melon. Perfect. Okay, so now we're, we're in business really, aren't we? Um, I knew these, these farms would pay off eventually. And I'm just organising this chest a little bit. Uh, so... We're going to get an, another hundred, and then maybe we can get a bit with nether warts. That's, that's the other idea. I mean, this is a pathetic nether wart farm. If we could make it into something special, I think that's, that's got to be next episode's project, hasn't it? A proper nether warts farm. I think that's, that's what I'm going to go for. But maybe in another area, and then if we make it really big, we can maybe get something from it. I don't think we'll quite have a stack of nether wart, but if we do, then that's, that'll be good, wouldn't it? Um, let's have a little see what have we got in here. Uh, now, you see, we've got 47... So it's def oh we should we should plant some more as well actually just so you know in between episodes it can sort of be growing. Hopefully I have just about enough money, but I think I might be just just short to get the uh, the name tag and the villager. What's my balance again? Let's have a little see. Four two five. So I need one hundred and seventy five. Okay. Um. So we're almost there. We just need a little bit more. You can't really bone mill uh, this either, can you? Um. I could. Uh, I'm not gonna be able to oh, I can sell the lapis and the ah, we're all right, we're all right, right. Let's uh, <laughs> let's go and put this uh, nether wart in the sh in the uh, in the the chest again, and let's uh, get back to the shop. I feel I like it when you're sort of scraping your funds together. I feel like you know, we're starting to see where we are, sort of a thing, and you know, uh, I can starting to work out what's gonna be the best way to uh, to get money, and it looks like um yeah. Cactus and nether wart is, uh, is definitely the way forward. Um, and it, I think over here is where you sell it. Yep, so redstone dust. Lapis. Have we got enough now? Let's have a little look. Look at that. 825. Where did all that come from? <laughs> How did I get so much money? I don't know. Is, is lapis worth more than I realise? Did I did it add more money? 100? That's, a, that's 250. That 250 somehow became like 400 or something. I don't know. <laughs> But I'm not complaining. Uh, right, so we're going to get a villager egg. There we go. And a name tag. Yes. A name tag. There we go. Now then, if my villager despawns or anything like that, I'm going to be very, very sad. Right, so we go uh, warp. Uh, no, we go IS home, don't we? So, well, just IS, I think. I don't know. Could I? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know how to get home, to be honest with you. Any other way. Um, oh. Oh, no. I need an anvil. <laughs> I didn't think about this, did I? <laughs> Do I have enough iron to make an anvil? Can you make an anvil? I hope you can. Um, let's have a little say. So I think I'm going to need three iron blocks. Okay. Um, oh, I think I might have enough. Okay. So then, how did I get three sea lanterns for doing that as well? Is it is it glitching or did somebody just give me? It? Okay. I think I think people give me stuff. How do you make an anvil? Um. Should have known that I wouldn't know how to make it out of there, wouldn't we? Right, I'm gonna find out the crafting recipe and uh, and be right back. Well, in all honesty, I was uh, I was miles away. Okay, so it, it it was iron blocks at the top, and then it's like iron in sort of like this shape. There we go. And we've got an anvil now. Perfect. So and then, and thanks very much for giving me this star. There's more people here. All right. Well, the donation chest is up and running now. You see, um, I might be cracking into this a few times though. <laughs> You gave me dimes as well. I might be tempted to use them as well. Um, so we've got that. Um, I think we don't need one of these furnaces myself. Uh, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get rid of one of these furnaces and replace it with an anvil. Yes, with an anvil. There we go. Now I feel like a man of means now I've got my anvil. Uh, so if we just ask you, you move. Thank you. Okay, hold on. Let me just go over here. All right. Le Why do I let people go over here? Because it just, it just gets annoying now. <laughs> oh, oh, wait. Have I just, someone just given me, oh, people are giving me money, that might be where my money's come from, maybe that's where it came from, I was confused with that, right, it's very kind of you, that can also go in that, that chest, but please don't give me too much, buddy, uh, see, you let one on, it, it goes crazy, doesn't it, right, so, I need to use that anvil, I forgot about that, um, <laughs> I shouldn't have pressure plates on the outside of my door, because now people can just get in my house as well, I'm, I'll be doing some adjustments now if we're going to start having visitors, um, so, I don't feel like I can name the villager till I see him. Actually, that's the problem. <laughs> I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to see him first before you can you can name a villager, right? Okay, villager. Let's see, because we don't know what type of villager we're gonna get, do we? Let's have a little look. All right, yeah, all right. He's a baker. Hmm. It's got to be Barry, hasn't it? Barry the baker. All right, Barry. You stay here. 
Is he a baker? Is he a butcher? It don't matter. He's still a bee. <laughs> get away with either. Right. Let's uh, let's name him Barry. Okay. Come on. Let's uh, let's do that. Barry. Perfect. Hey. Eh? And now if we go and name him, he shouldn't despawn. And then and then we'll be sorted. We'll have we'll have a non-despawning villager. It'll be perfect. Right, Barry. Oh no. How do I do this? How do I, how do I use a name tag? Please let me tell me I can use a name tag, Barry. Oh no, don't tell me. Oh, please. <laughs> I look, I'd love to trade some raw pork chops with you, but I, I want to name you. How do I name? How do you use a name tag? Um, Let's have a C. That doesn't work. Right. I don't want to use this name tag on someone else, though. I'll, maybe I'll have to. Don't go outside. Right, look, it's getting dark, okay? But don't panic, okay? We'll, we'll put some torches down. Uh, just just hold on, Barry, okay? If he despawns, I'm going to be so upset. I will be. Um, okay. <laughs> uh, let's um, let's go back. I'm sure you must be able to put name tags on villagers. Maybe you can't. Maybe villagers just don't despawn. Maybe that's, that's a thing, yeah. Right, so let's put a torch there, a torch there, and a torch there, and finally there. So that, that should light up your house nicely, Barry. Um, well, yeah, this is your new home anyway, okay? I'm I'm sorry that you you can't do that. Uh, oh, did it do it? Ah, I got it. Yes. Ah, just kept spamming it and it worked. Hello, Barry. <laughs> well, that's that sorted. As long as we don't let any zombies near him or anything, we'll we'll be all right. All right, Barry, enjoy your new home. Okay. <laughs> well, that bombshell. We're out of time this episode. <laughs> Um, so yeah, I'm gonna get another chicken at some point, um, and I'm gonna call him Charlie again. We'll just we'll just say that Charlie's gone for a bit of a holiday while he's let his grass grow. Yeah, that's that's what actually happened. That that could be what happened. I, I didn't kill him. Nobody killed him. He just despawned, didn't it? Wait, well, didn't despawn. He he went for a wonder. Um, so <laughs> yeah, but yeah, if you did enjoy this video, please do make sure to leave a like and also subscribe if you're new around here for daily videos of Minecraft. And there was something I said I was gonna do next episode. I can't remember what it was now. Oh, Nether Warts Farm. That's what's that's what's going. We're going to make it on a big scale, I think, as well. I think that's going to be for the best, isn't it? Uh, so yeah, as I said, guys, thanks so much for watching, and hopefully I will see you next time.